He said those goddamn Pakistanis in their goddamn corner shops. Built a shop on every corner, took our British workers' jobs. He said those goddamn Chinese in their goddamn China shops. I told him they're from Vietnam, but he doesn't give a toss. I ask him what was there before that damn Japan man's shop. He looks at me and dreams a scene of British workers' jobs. A full-time, full employment before the goddamn boats all came where everybody went to work for full-time, full hours, every day. A British business stood there first, he claims, before the Irish came. Now British people lost their jobs and bloody Turkish there to blame. I ask him how he knows that fact. He said, because it's true. I ask him how he knows it's fact. He said he read it in the news. Every time a Somalian comes here, they take a job from us. The mathematics one for one from us to them, it just adds up. He bites his cake. He sips his brew. He says again he knows the plot. The goddamn Caribbeans came and now good folk here don't have jobs. I ask him what was there before the goddamn Persian curtain shop. I show him architectures, plans, empty plots and barren land. There was no goddamn shop before those Pakistanis came and planned. Man, I'm sick of crappy mathematics because I love a bit of sums. I spent three years studying economics and I geek out over calculus. And when I meet these paper claims that one of every nude that came takes away our daily wage, I desperately want to scream your maths is stuck in primary. Because some who come here also spend, and some who come here also lend, and some who come here also tend to set up work which employs them, and all those balance sheets and trends, they work with numbers, not with men. And all this goddamn heated talk ignores the trade the Polish brought, ignores the men they give work to, not plumbing jobs but further too. Ignores the guys they buy stock from, accountants, builders, on and on. And I know it's nice to have someone to blame our lack of jobs upon, but immigration's not that plain despite the sums inside our brains as one for one, as him or you, as if he goes home, they'd employ you. Because sometimes one that comes makes two, and sometimes one can add three more, and sometimes two times two is much, much more than four. And most times, immigrants bring more than minuses. BBC Asian Network. Mim Shake.